There's a new, new game, game mode. mode. And nobody knows about it? Mmm, it's an orange juice. They've been hiding a new game mode from us, and I, I didn't know for the longest time. It's been at least two days, and I had no idea. In the maintenance update, they snuck in Rascal Girl Brawl. I've never seen this in my life, and it spawns Rascal Girls very, very fast. I would say, like, every seven seconds, a Rascal Girl spawns in at double elixir at two minutes, and then triple elixir. It's a ramp-up challenge as well, so there are a ton of Rascals in here. Obviously, I have three hard counters for Rascals, and I have the Ice Golem strictly to tank for the rascals when they cross the bridge and then have the volcano for when the rascals cross my bridge and vault and wizard as well splashy splashers are going to be so good for this challenge but what's going to be even better is if you buy the season pass in terms of progression it's one of the best values in the game if not the best in the game before you do that make sure to use code oj and the okay good i'm supporting myself the code does expire every seven days we get a small kickback in that so thank you everyone that does support us i'm going to try this deck in the challenge right now it's not even a challenge, it's just in war. And the reason why I'm playing war is because we are looking to recruit 40 good war attackers. This is the clan, and this is the level one clan that we want to bring to Legendary League. But to do that, we're gonna need very active war attackers. We are looking for people to join. Make sure it's orange ones with the uh, clan tag Y09QY8LJ. We will accept serious war attackers, preferably with maxed out level 12, 13 cards, just so that we can push the legendary as fast as possible. We're basically looking for full participation in every single war. All three prep attacks, all attacks for war day, every single day. If you don't attack, if you're under leveled, we will kick you. This isn't a traditional clan where I'm gonna be recruiting people, where we're gonna chat and have fun. Honestly, I'm not even gonna chat in this clan. So if you do join this, please don't expect that. We're, we're strictly here to push. And if you're not here to push, please don't join. And by pushing, I mean pushing this clan to Legendary League. And then we're going to, after we get to Legendary League, we're going to be the first and the only level one clan to be in Legendary League. We're actually going to kick every single person. So please don't get attached to this clan. If you have your mini account and you want to join and help us push, that'd be super cool. I have three accounts in this clan and I think this deck is going to work really well. So I'm going to go do the Rascal Girls on my level 12 mini account. The Rascals spawn very, very rapidly. I don't even feel like I really want to use the log just yet. It's only one Rascal. Oh, it's a level 10 Rascal. That's pleasant. My Rascal is going to win, but in terms of interactions, they're both going to two-shot each other. So it's not really going to change it too much in single elixir just because they're going to cancel each other out at the bridge. Oh, no. My Rascal wins. That's toxic. Why am I matched against level 10 right now? And then the Ice Golem just is so much value. That's beautiful. Oh gosh. I don't have any anti-air. Whoa, wait. The Rascals are anti-air. I guess Balloon's not that good. Come on, Valkyrie. Do your thing. Tank for the tower. Take it all out. We have arrows. We have arrows. Did I only get two minions with the... Yes, I did, but that's fine. The Rascal Girl single-handedly took everything out. I'm going to log that just because I can. Oh, beautiful. I don't even want to start using my spells just quite yet. Okay, I'm using my spells right now. Let's get the Rascal Girls. Three Rascals, two waves, and the Witch. We're getting everything. Did I need to use Valkyrie? No, I needed to use a Wizard there. We're going to... We're gonna take some ouchies from the tower, not gonna lie. But we're still winning. We're, we're wrecking the other side, very good. Wait for it, put the ice golem down, tank for the rascal girls. Maybe go for a happy little poison on the witch and the rascal waves. Oh, that's gonna be value. I know I could save my arrows for the minion horde, but I don't really need to. We're just gonna slowly defend and everything. This is, this is absolute chaos and I love it. I'm gonna put a Valkyrie right in front of there. Oh my gosh, Minion Horde is going to get melted by all those Rascals. Oh, no. I've never seen so many Rascal Girls on the map before. This is great. It's not even triple Elixir yet. They're not even triple spawning. I will maybe use the log to take out two waves. Poison to take out two waves on the right side and address that Witch. I know he's going to put Minion Horde on top. Oh, rap. he's going for, for that instead. I, I can deal with that. I can dig that. Holy heck. If that Valkyrie got in front, that would have been obnoxiously strong. I'm just going to start using arrows on the tower right now because I, I want it gone. It's gone. 37 damage. Not enough power. They're only level 10. 
Not like this! Let's poison that. We're gonna get so many rascal girls. Y'all didn't even get to witness the glory of the triple rascal girls. Oh my gosh. Let's use arrows on all of them. That's just obnoxiously strong. I could spell cycle, and I think I will spell cycle. We're not even gonna try here. I'm good. It's kind of expensive to spell cycle, but we're gonna make it work. And that's it. Triple spells are so worth it in this challenge. So I can throw the cards. Come on, come on. There it is, Rascal Girls. Copy the deck onto my mini mini account. Uh, I don't think this is tournament standard, so I'm actually gonna upgrade everything. Make sure this isn't my level one account or I will cry. My mini mini accounts, I'm gonna leave this clan once level 12s and 13s start showing up, so. Or it's gonna be absolute. Oh my gosh, it's level eight? War is weird. Matchmaking is so weird if you're not in Legendary League. That is so wacky. I'm not even gonna do a wizard. I'm probably just gonna do a Valkyrie on that side and then I'm, I'll do an Ice Golem on the left side. Cause I don't want the Valkyrie to really cross the bridge just quite yet. Oh my gosh, we're gonna poison that witch so good. And we're gonna log the Dark Goblin on the left side. Oh my gosh, don't bring Dark Goblin or Princess in this challenge. My level 10, plus two Rascal Girl survive. That's obnoxiously strong. And survives for the next wave. That's not fair. Well, I guess neither is war in this matchmaking area. Oh my gosh, it's almost double elixir. I just want to use poison on that wizard on the right side. That's nice. I'm still waiting for the dark goblin, wherever it is. Now we're going to use arrows on that side. Oh, beautiful. I'm going to do a baby dragon on the right side. I want them to kind of tank for everything. Maybe rascals and the scar me on there to tank for the left side. It looks like it's chaos, but it's not really chaos. Quite yet. I do want to use poison that wizard and the two rascals upcoming. We'll do arrows just so that my Valkyrie can really get the tower. And I predicted the Dark Goblins. Totally predicted. 100% predicted. I called it out. I didn't call anything out. <laughs> All right, let's do a Musketeer on the backside. And then I... It doesn't look like he, he even brought any spells. Yes. We're just going to double stack my Musketeer and Wizard on the right lane. Just, just because. Just because we know he has no spells. Ice Golem's gonna come in to tank for everything, so I'm not afraid to center plant the Valkyrie. Connect to the tower! And that's a quick, easy one. Arrows right there, because Rascal Girls do deal a lot of damage. And I'm gonna do a wizard on the right side. I just want to get rid of everything, destroy him, destroy his hopes and dreams, and everything else. Oh my gosh, I'm not supporting Code OJ on my mini account. What if I accidentally bought something? <laughs> Such as the season pass. Y'all see these gem deals? They're okay. You see these legendary chest, royal chest deals? They are terrible. Do not buy these chest deals. But the season pass, that's a different thing. In terms of progression, the season pass is so, so good. I mean, if you want to get emotes that are exclusive for the next three months, that's a different reason too. This account kind of does need this. I, I will get it. This is my mini, mini account. So I actually could use a few of these cards. Oh, bats, yes. Level nine bats, that's what I need. Tournament standard P.E.K.K.A., that's nice. Level 9 Giant, come to me. Yes. We really only need Tournament Standard stuff. Wow. Tournament Standard Barrel right off the bat. This account is lacking a lot of Legendary, so this chest was actually worth it for me. I'm running a little bit low on gold. Unlock that, uh, that Electro Wizard. We're set. We're good. And we get the Hunter Mode. That's cool. Now that I have more gold, upgrade my Earthquake. Upgrade my Giant. Upgrade my P.E.K.K.A. Straight Max Barbarian Barrel. Well... To tournament standard in one chest. Those are so good for level 10 accounts. Holy heck, 1010 would recommend. It, it, honestly, it's not the best deal. If you play it out in the long term, season passes are probably the only way I would spend gems. When I played Clash of Clans, I only spent gems to boost, and that's how I would recommend it back then. But now that you have all these package deals, and it just makes so much more sense. Uh, okay, we gotta rotate back to the Rascal Girls, so I'm gonna. I'll be right back as I crush my opponents. Triple crown, undefeated. I think this is my last war attack too, so we just need to get one more in and then we'll be pretty much set. Please come join, we need help. 
We're, we're not getting good collection cards. Again, the clan is orange ones. The clan tag is Y09QY8LJ. We'll accept anyone. That's maxed out and it's good. Wait, what? I want my rascal game. What? Fine, we'll just play triple elixir. Gotta upgrade that skeleton. Tournament. Plus one skeletons are so obnoxiously good. Are we just gonna play triple elixir? We're just gonna end his pain real quick. I'm gonna go for magic archer. This is the nerfed magic archer. Six tiles. What were you thinking, Supercell? Why not 6.5? Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna rocket that. We ain't got we ain't got no time for no wizard splashy splashers. Oh, I'm gonna double up on there. Since that magic archer is locked on, I'm gonna put skeletons on top of it. Skeletons wreck his magic archer. Goblin, giant tanking for the Mega Knight. We have two magic archers on the map, two flying machines, and he has no spells to address them. That was actually pretty decent. We still have two magic archers in there, though. Oh, that's beautiful. We haven't even shown him the power of Sparky yet. Maybe I will show him the power of Sparky. Put it in the back. Just a little bit lower. You got the Sparky. I believe in you. Magic Archer on top there. Sparky takes out the Mega Knight. Just almost. I'm going to do Skeletons on the right side. Holy heck, he is very, going very aggressive on the right side. All right. Well, then I'm going to do a Sparky on the right side. I don't like this. He's actually dealing damage. I was better off not with my Sparky. Okay, that, that's, that's scary. I need to zap that. Magic Archer, even though you're only 6 tile range... You're still effective against Minion Horde. I, I, I believe in you. Oh my gosh. Everything just connects. He's actually connecting on the right side. He's got a, a level 11 roll giant. What a cheater. Zap, zap that Minion Horde. I don't like it. I've played nine games, and I've never lost. The one game where he's plus two levels, I decide to record, but that's okay here. I didn't really lose because we're all winners, because we all use code OJ. And I'm kind of bummed out about that, and the Rascal Brawl is back in rotation, I'm sad. Collection day is complete. It takes so much to rotate it back now that 2v2 is out, that's weird. That's going to be it for this video. This isn't the perfect deck for Rascal Girls. I feel like I rarely did use the Baby Dragon. Maybe a cheaper tank would make more sense as well. But that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And a new challenge that Supercell didn't even tell me about. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more quality OJ.